Welcome and welcome to today's episode. Today I'm reviewing the poinsettia. Uh, scientific name, Pulcherima. Sorry, Euphoria Pulcherima. Anyway, so uh, we got this for free. Normally it's red. People are like, what the hell's going on? It's supposed to be red. And I, I'm like, yeah, but apparently this is old, I guess. I don't know. So they start going yellow. Apparently the leaves change color. I mean, the flower petals this is the weird looking flowery plant look at that so weird anyway i came to north america when i was a wee lad with a british accent i was like pip pip cheerio and they're like who the hell is this kid he just snuck on the airplane get him and i was like allahu akbar and i threw them a bag and they're like terrorists and i was like no no that's a bag of candy i have my visa right here but you know whatever so um what was I saying again? Oh yeah, I was reviewing these. So I didn't really have these in England. And it was weird, like, I'm sure that someone has them somewhere. But I don't remember seeing these as a kid. Like, I left England when I was, like, 16, 17. Um, and I really honestly don't remember seeing poinsettias there. It, it was just like, or maybe it's just not a big thing. Maybe no one gives a two hoots about poinsettias in England. It's not like here in Canada where everyone just loses their mind. You know, they have these things on back order. They're like, got to get your poinsettias for Christmas. And you're like, what the flip? Calm down, bruvs. What? It's just a plant that happens to be red and green. Oh, yeah, I just realized the color of the holidays. I don't know where the hell red and green came from. Actually, I do. It's a long story. Santa Claus used to be green. Then Coca-Cola made him red. And then the Macy's went and added Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer as a song to sell more product and blah, blah, blah. The point is, is that, um, yeah, this is kind of the color of the holidays. And it's really near Christmas, although when this actually publishes, it will be March. So it's kind of redundant. I'm sorry, everyone. I, I know I'm filming this in like December. It's literally Christmas is two days away. Uh, and people are going to be like, Christmas? That, I, I remember Christmas. But when I was, yeah, anyway, I've got a backlog of videos. I can't release this any closer to Christmas. I'm sorry. I have like, I edit like in month batches. And currently I've been on a crazy editing spree. And I've edited like, what, um, up until March 10th. So this will probably come out March 12th. Why the hell am I telling you guys this? Hey, I'm not even reviewing this. I'm just like talking and pointing the camera. Okay, so let's look at the plant. Does it smell? Not really. I don't know if these smell normally. Like I've had some people, I, I knew a lady once who was like, I'm allergic to them. Get them away from me. They're diseased. But I don't, I've never really smelled anything from these. Mind you, my sense of smell sucks, but... I don't know. I think they're just mostly decorative for the red and green fatigue for people. Uh, plant care. These things like to be near windows. Uh, they they like loose uh, peat kind of soil. And water them whenever you feel the, the plant is dry in the bottom. If it's dry, water the damn thing. Unless it's like a cactus, then, then don't. But that's the general rule of thumb with plants, you know. Water them when they're dry. Put your finger on the soil unless you have one of those weird phobias. Hantamovus phobias. I don't know. I made that up. That's probably not a real phobia. Anyway, so that's my review of the poinsettia. Um, I gave you some plant care tips. Uh, do I like it? Honestly, no. I, I don't like poinsettias. Not like I dislike them. It's not like I hate the damn thing. Get them away from me. No, it's it's more just like, I don't know, they're just like that, that plant that everyone has that you can't really be bothered with. Like mistletoe, you know, who the hell actually cares about mistletoe? Unless like you're, you know, one of those geeky teens looking to get a kiss from your best friend's older sister, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know? But the point is, is that it's just one of these weird Christmas plants. I don't know, I, I, I'm just going to give it like... A thumbs up for being there, but not really anything else. Doesn't have a great scent, doesn't have a great flowery look. But it's there, so uh, there it is.
Anyway, feel free to subscribe. You know, the regular blah, blah, blah that YouTubers do at the end of their show. You know, where they say, please subscribe, I need subscribers. Or where they say, the first to 10 million subscribers get a prize. And the prize is a photo of me, you signed, smiling, thanks for the prize. I don't know. I'm, I'm not one of those YouTubers that does that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.